using a rocket launcher, well, it's clearly got its advantages. But, it does also have its disadvantages. So, let me show you them. First, you're going to want to craft a rocket launcher. It also cost you 80 polymer, 50 metal, and 60 paste. A pretty simple recipe, but simple doesn't always mean cheap. One rocket launcher will go through 20 rockets before breaking. And as for the rockets, this is where things get a little dicey. One of them is going to cost you 40 gunpowder, 10 crystal, 20 paste, 10 polymer, and 12 metal. Overall, a little more expensive than C4, and also a little less effective. And what do I mean by it's a little less effective? Well, it does a bit less damage. Let's get into showing the structures and how much damage to take from rockets, and I'll also show you the comparisons with C4. Well, we have thatch. And we have a game. <laughs> Blowing up thatch almost made my game crash, but yeah, as you can see, um, obviously it does not even begin to stand a chance. Next we have wood. Full health. And this, well this might actually surprise you. That was no trick. A wood wall can survive a rocket and still have about a quarter of its health left. This is why I don't recommend rocket wasting rockets on wood. Now we have stone. Well, stone, you need to break stone, as is to be expected. Uh, metal. Metal might be a problem. And tech. It, it barely scratches tech. 21 rockets to take down a tech wall. As you can see, the damage for rockets isn't all that great. But that's not where its problem ends. Turrets are a very big issue. One of the rocket launcher's greatest disadvantages is that it can be shot out of the air. So right around there is where the turret range starts and really there's no way for me to rockets go around it. It's like an invisible fucking wall of no rockets allowed. And if you're quick and you have some decent aim, you don't even need a turret. You know what? I just won't bring my rocket to turret fights then. Usually, you don't fight people in turrets, so that might not seem like such a big deal, but with a little bit of skill... You can shoot rockets out of the air. No, that wasn't a fluke. So I'm a little slow on my aim, but imagine what someone with mouse and keyboard could do. Because again, I am on console. Just take it straight- and this is the long neck. This is one of the- This is literally the worst weapon I could possibly think of to shoot a rocket out of the air. So if someone shoots a rocket at you, you're quick enough. You can just shoot it. Well, the rocket launcher is just shaping up to be a worthless hunk of shit. And that's not necessarily true. See, C4 has incredibly short range. Literally, as far as your arm can put it. A rocket, however, the ability to shoot further away is not something that should just be discredited entirely. Rockets also have the ability to detonate an explosive immediately. To detonate a piece of C4, you gotta put it down and then blow it up. And there's usually a very large amount of delay involved in that process. With a rocket, you just press the shoot button and boom, something's gonna explode. This makes it very well suited for turret runs because you can just run up and blow it instantly and there's less opportunity for the turrets to kill you. Overall, rocket launchers are much more niche tools that are only suited for a couple purposes and to be honest, you'll find yourself using C4 much more often. I hope you guys enjoyed the guide, and please do leave a like and subscribe if you did. Now, go out there and blow some shit up.